Hi, in this episode I'll start discussing the Select and Transform tool and before that let's create a simple shape here. Grab the Select and Transform tool, also you can access that with F1. And here we have some arrows around the object and if we grab this one, click and hold, we can adjust the width of the object. Here we can adjust the height and with this one on the corner we can adjust both the width and the height. Now if you hold down the control key you will keep the aspect ratio. You see how that works. Now if you hold down the shift key and click on, for example on this arrow you see how we are adjusting both sides of the width and also we are expanding from the center Let's try it with the other arrow here. You see how that works, holding down the shift key. Now if we click on the object one more time, we will get some additional options here. We can rotate the object, control Z to undo that. We can skew it vertically or horizontally. And again, if we hold down the control key here and start rotating, we will be rotating at 15 degrees. You see how that works. You can also see the information down here. Now, if we hold down the shift key, now have in mind that we have a point here at the center of our object. And if I'm not holding any key and just rotating, I'm rotating around that point. And let's say I want to rotate from um, some other point. Let's grab this and move it here. And now I'll be rotating from that point. Let's undo that. And uh, if I hold down the shift key and click on this arrow here, I'll be rotating from the opposite. I'll move this point here. You see that how that works? It will be rotating from there by holding down the shift key. Also, we can click on the object and move it around. Now, in the next tutorial, we'll continue discussing some of the options for this tool, which are located here.